Searching with subject terms can help you get fewer, more useful results. But what is a subject term, and how is it different than a keyword? Keyword searching looks for your search terms anywhere in the article's record. The record includes citation information, such as author and title, the abstract, and subject terms. Keyword searching sometimes brings up articles that aren't actually on your topic. This article's record was retrieved from a search on Native Americans. Notice that both words appear in the abstract, even though the article has nothing to do with Native Americans. Subject terms are a little like tags used in social media. Tags show the main topic of the video, photo, or blog post. For example, this YouTube video from the College of DuPage Library has several tags. Notice the words they have used. College, but not university. Copies, but not photocopies. Print, but not printing. How do you determine what words to use when tagging something? Think about how you would tag this picture. What words would you use to describe it? Maybe forest? Woods? Maybe nature? Or trees? Maybe path? If you knew where it was taken, you might use Lindenwood Nature Preserve. So what happens if you've tagged this picture forest and someone searches using the tag trees? That's where subject terms come in. Subject terms are controlled vocabulary, meaning there is a set list of terms to use for different topics. Using subject terms can save you time and give you a much more focused set of results. But how do you know what terms to use? Sometimes it's not obvious. This subject search for Native Americans only retrieved 12 results. You can see one of the subjects is Native Americans in motion pictures. Most EBSCO databases have a search feature to find subject terms. Click on subject terms or subjects at the top of the page. Enter your topic where it says browsing. Notice that entering Native Americans retrieves the correct subject terms, Indians of North America. Using the correct subject term, Indians of North America retrieves 9,823 results. Each of these will have something to do with Native Americans. Now you can narrow your search. You can also get more information if you click on the heading when you find it in the index. Clicking on Indians of North America will open a list of other terms. You will find narrower terms such as specific tribes of Native Americans and related terms such as Indian reservations and Native Americans in motion pictures. You may also find broader terms and a list of topics the subject is used for such as American Indians. Reviewing the subject lists attached to articles in your results list can also give you the right subject terms. You can also do a keyword search and then look at the subject terms attached to the articles in your results list. This example shows one result of a keyword search for Native Americans. In the subject list, you will notice Indians of North America. Once you learn how to search with subject terms, you will get much more targeted results from your searches. If you have questions or need more assistance, ask a librarian.